Hey YouTubers, it's Mark from Truth Seeker, and I'm in Soul 657, and uh, it's just the anomalies are just uh, amazing, absolutely breathtaking, amazing. I mean, just look at this. These two items right here. Let's see how close I can get you. to be about it. And then I'm going to pan back here and look at this area here. Now you can see the blurring that they put through here, but it looks like some type of plant. You see all the piping? This is not pixelization because it's not through the whole photograph and it's not this is not uh, from the camera because this is not being shown in other photographs that I looked at you can see where they manipulated the picture I mean, look at this. it looks like there's poles coming up To see where they uh, they went to town with just blurriness. They put this white haze over it. And you see, they add some of these black smudges. So from a distance, we can't really tell what we're looking at. It really throws you off. I mean, just look at this. There's no way that this is pixelization. See the way it comes up and then it curls under? Okay, that's some type of carving. That's just not happening in nature. That I can guarantee you. This is, see these black smudges? This is when they really need to hide something. See how they just put it around everything? I believe as they get closer, oh, look at this stuff. You know, as they get closer to Mount Shark, This stuff is just undeniable. And why they're even letting us see this, I, uh, you know, I question that myself because there's no reason for them to. Somebody wants us to see it. Somebody's sneaking this out. It's part of a big government plan. You know, is a soft rollout of disclosure. So. We don't uh, cause a disruption in our banking systems and uh, society, and our economy. That's there's a lot of things that have to be taken in. You know, it's not just uh, hey, we found uh, life on Mars. There's a lot of things that are tied to it. I mean, religions would collapse. I mean, just look at those couple of nitwits from Heaven's Gate. Look at this. Looks like your typical alien head. Two eyes, the nose. Comes down onto some type of statue. I mean, look at this. I mean, what, what else do you really need to see? I mean, look at the buildings back here, the structure. There's windows. I mean, look at this building back here. I mean, it just looks like an ancient... Look at it. You could see the, the pillars. I mean, I don't know what else I have to show some people, but I know most of you guys get it. <laughs> yeah. 
I mean, why this isn't on the news or all over Yahoo, Google, I have no idea because this is absolutely amazing. NASA should be proud to release stuff like this. When I was a kid, I used to think, when I was real young, I used to think, man, every day I was checking the newspaper and, you know, looking for that little science section, you know, because we didn't have internet or nothing, you know, and just always hoping, you know, getting popular science and, you know, these, I think there was like one astronomy magazine. And just hoping, you know, that I was going to see, uh, hey, they found something, they found something, and you know, it never. Then I started to realize there's a whole another side to this. It's not just that easy of saying, oh, yeah, we found life. I used to think our government would be proud, you know, to say, hey, we were the first ones to find it. Look at how fake this area looks. Like, you see this area? See, I believe this is water. Let me zoom out and show you what I'm talking about. See this part of the photo? You got the front, and then you come here, and then they got this middle that they always add this weird... It's just weird. It's just... Look at the edges, okay? I'm going to zoom in as close as I can, and I want you to look at the edges, and you can see how they're cutting into that. I believe there's water in this area. You see this? There's all type of piping. Now, it would make a lot of sense if there was water in this area. Why you would have all this machinery and, you know, buildings and stuff here. But you see how this line is? You'll see when you download the photo. You can see all the hazing that they put. Just total manipulation of these photos. Look at these fittings and pipes. And this looks like some type of circular tank. This thing looks like some type of craft. And look at this, look what's hidden in here. It's like huge factories, huge plants. Let's see how close I can get and steady it for you. There's just a maze of piping and machinery and carving of the face. There you go, look at look at these entryways. You 
walk right in here. Looks like some type of tank with a pipe coming out. Way. Here, look at this. Look at this perfect arch. And you can see the different colors of the brick or stone or whatever it is. I don't even know why they bother putting this haze over everything. Just the contrast and the brightness and you can see what's here you don't even have to invert this area and as always I'll give you all the links always I never do a video without the links and Will from what's up in the sky was mentioning something that NASA changed around the, uh, the links that they're not working so I'm gonna have to go back and check some of my videos and see if it's not uh, I'll change all the links but Will from what's up in the sky 37 was saying something about when you click on the link to the picture it doesn't take you to the right page so of course that's another new way of NASA you know manipulating us but that's all right. Look at this weird stuff under here. And you can see it. Look at car more carvings. Look at this stuff. This is almost the same exact stuff that I found in my other picture that I just did. Oh, this looks like a wire mesh. And then you can see there's a design in the center. Looks like a building back here. You can see the windows and openings. More buildings along the ridge here. Look at this piece of equipment. It's got a base, and it looks like it's got a huge arm with something extending out over. Now, I believe all this heavy black is just water. They're just covering it up. Look at this thing hanging out here. It looks like some type of craft, a rocket. But man, that is strange. Here must have been something really good. Look at how they put that heavy weight. I'm going to give this a quick invert and see what happens too. Sometimes you can pick up a lot of detail. Look at this. looks like a light that stands out from everything in this area. It looks to be self-illuminated. Okay. My God, NASA. 
Let me get this stable. Look at this stuff. This looks like a tank with piping. unbelievable um, I am so amazed with these past couple of souls that I've done I just can't believe what I'm seeing sorry about that look at this what the hell is that what are we looking at oh, this looks like a cross Carving. This looks like a giant piece of machinery. Gigantic. I mean, this looks like some type of craft. Let me see how close I can get you in there. Just hold on, guys. Let me get it focused. Let me see how close I can get you in there. Look at this. This looks like some a small building. Look at this sign down here. Look at this. I mean, just look at this stuff. Oh, my God. NASA. Look at this. They, they have to want us to see this. Look at this. putting this white smudge here, here, and here. They know we're doing these pictures. There's another building. I mean, they know we're doing it. I just... They have to want us to see this stuff. I mean, it's just... Come on. look like those uh, NASA habitats, the, the cylinders that uh, they would live in.
and there's this entryway. Something just that comes out. It looks like on an arm. Look at these tanks. Yep. I really just don't know what to say. I'm absolutely amazed. I'm almost speechless. Structures, buildings. I mean, there's just no, in my mind, there's no question whatsoever what's going on here. The only questions that are really left for me are why? Why haven't we been told? And why does NASA even show us this stuff? But as far as this stuff being there, I have no question anymore. And you shouldn't either. What you should be doing is emailing NASA and asking them why you've been lied to most of your life. Alright guys, you know what to do. Please, if you like what I'm doing, bang that like button. Subscribe. You know, do all that good stuff. Share it with people. Tell someone. Email NASA. I got a couple more I'm working on. I'll see you on the next one, guys. Truth Seekers out.